Uh, hello to everyone. My name is Adilet, and uh, today <coughs> uh, I am here uh, to show you my presentation. Uh, first of all, uh, first of all, uh, let me uh, tell uh, what I going, what I am going uh, to do. Uh, today I am going to tell you uh, ab about uh, my name's uh, origin uh, and uh, some interesting facts. Uh, Adilet uh, has uh, 13 for <laughs> 13 uh, for nosomatic, uh, clearly uh, marked signs. Uh, so brave, bright, uh, safe. Uh, good uh, and uh, happy. Uh, uh, translated from Kazakh, uh, my uh, name uh, means uh, honest, uh, fairy, and Honest, fair, fair, and uh, true. Uh, calling the same name uh, of his son, parents uh, want uh, uh, him to grow honest, uh, uh, decent, uh, dignified, and uh, happy life. Democratic. Uh, it's a democratic party. Uh, Adilet. Uh, I think, uh, in my opinion, I think uh, name uh, partly uh, influenced uh, to f uh, future, to your future. And uh, for example, it's uh, Birman Kulov Adilet Nazarbayevich, uh, master of unarmed uh, combat, president, president ALE, uh, Thai Massive Association. In myth, now I want uh, to show you uh, some pictures uh, about uh, my name. Uh, uh, in uh, mythology, uh, my name, uh, no, Adlet, uh, <coughs> in mythology, uh, Inuits of uh, Labrador and uh, has <coughs> and uh, has them uh, bay uh, coast monsters. Uh, and uh, uh, this is a creature's uh, the uh, creature's uh, upper body uh, upper body uh, was as a human and uh, lower was as a, a dog or wolf uh, and uh, according to myth uh, they crossed the sea and uh, gave to European uh, peoples uh, 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 gave birth to European uh, peoples. Uh, and that's all what I want to tell you about uh, my presentation. If you have some questions, you are welcome. Hello, everybody. Uh, as all the people, I have my own name. My birth name is Aitore. Uh, I, I like my name for ma many reasons. Why one reason that I like my name is it's unique and I don't have yet met a person with the same name as me. Uh, Aitore was the name that my grandfather wanted for me. And uh, what about the meaning of my name? Aitore consists of two words, I and Ture. The word I means moon, because of I was born in moonlight. 
in the word Turi, it means governor, because of my um, parents' wish that when I grow up, I will uh, govern the states. For example, like uh, our governor of South Kazakhstan region, Askar Mirzahmed. Uh, I don't have any famous person in this name, so I hope that I will the first famous person in the name Aitore. And uh, I would like to be as our president, Nurstan Nazarbayev. Uh, I admire his political and econo economical sense. And in addition, I can say he's the first mm, famous person who has the name Nurstan. And uh, he's the first celebrity in this name. Uh, I really like my name, and uh, and uh, I really my I, I really like my name. It me it has a great meaning, and uh, my name is Awesome, and I I I'm happy that I have this name. So it happened 17 years ago when I spent uh, when uh, my parents spent their honeymoon in Malaysia. Uh, after a disco which took place every night, my mom was very tired, and uh, she went to her room. Um, she had been uh, sweet, uh, sh it was hot in the room. She opened the window, turned on the TV, and uh, she had been switching channels for a long time. Uh, when at last uh, she found a Russian one, which was in an old hotel of the world. Um, Uh, the film uh, had only started, and uh, at uh, that moment my uh, father came, and uh, they together began to watch it. Um, uh, the film's name uh, was uh, Return to Eden. Uh, one of the heroes of this film uh, was uh, Prince Amal, uh, and uh, he was a positive person from all sides. Uh, Uh, he drew attention to himself uh, because uh, he was very honest and uh, he, uh, he had another good qualities. Um, at that moment, uh, my parents uh, had a son. Uh, his name is Ruslan. Uh, so uh, they decided to call the following child uh, in honor of the prince. Uh, but if they had a girl, they would name her Amalia. Uh, if a boy, Amal. Uh, so uh, I got this name. Um, Mm, uh, my mom says that uh, um, I uh, correspond uh, to uh, the prince, uh, to this prince, uh, because uh, in uh, the prince's uh, qualities, uh, such as uh, uh, hard working, uh, understanding, uh, and uh, uh, compassion, and uh, she added uh, that uh, if uh, that maybe I won't be a prince in my uh, adult life, uh, but I will take high position in the sphere of business. Um, unfortunately, I didn't find some celebrities uh, with my name, uh, but uh, I uh, found some um, Arab sheikh with this name, um, and uh, it doesn't it, uh, it it it's not surprising because uh, it's Arabic name and it means hope. Um, mm, I like my name because uh, it's not absolutely usual. And uh, the meaning of uh, its name fits me because I'm this uh, type of person. But sometimes I want to, uh, to change it because I hear it too often during the day uh, from my dad. Um, Amal, come here. Amal, clean up after the dog. And stu uh, stu stuff like this. It's uh, everything what I want uh, to tell you about my name. If uh, you have any questions, you are welcome. My name is Nastya and today I would like to show you my presentation on the theme My favorite name Anastasia And for the beginning I would like to talk about the meaning of my name uh, Anastasia is a Greek name and the female form of the Greek male name Anastasios or Anastasius uh, Meaning the resurrection 
resurrection it means when person died uh, happened like a wonder and this person have the second chance to live also the name and its male counterpart were often given to children born around the 2nd of december or uh, around the uh, easter during the early days of christianity now i would like to talk about some famous people with the same name as i have and the first uh, is Anastasia Romanovna Zaharina Yurevna. She was born in 1530 and died in uh, 1560. She was the first wife of the Russian Tsar Ivan the Terrible, and also she was the first Russian Tsaritsa. It's widely believed that Anastasia had a moderating influence on the Ivan's volatile character. Here you see some pictures of her, the second picture, she uh, with her husband Ivan the Terrible. Next person is Anastasia Alexandrovna Vertinskaya. Uh, she was born uh, on 19 uh, of December in 1944 in Moscow. She is Russian and Soviet actress whose mass popularity and high critical acclaim made her one of the most distinguished figures in the history of Soviet cinema. She went abroad to teach and spent 12 years in France, England, uh, United States and Switzerland. And uh, as you see, she was really beautiful. Uh, speaking about her filmography, uh, it was really big, uh, and here you see some of her films. I would like to talk only about the first film, Scarlet Sales. It was her first film, which made her very popular. She had a leading role, and here you see the first picture, uh, Vertinska as a soul in this film. The second picture, Vertinska as Ophelia. Uh, I would like to talk about advantages of my name. The first advantage is that my name has two forms, the short form Anast uh, Nastya and the long form Anastasia. Uh, and in my opinion it's really comfortable and it's not boring because there are names uh, who have not this opportunity, for example, Eva or Nina. Second advantage is that a lot of well-known people have the same name uh, as I have and sometimes I feel proud about it. Uh, next advantage that this name is one of the most beautiful names all over the world and it's my own opinion because everyone has their own taste about uh, their names. So I am very fond of, of my name. And the last and the most important that m uh, my name was given to me by my grandmother and I'm really thankful for her. My father wanted to call me Irina and my mother uh, wanted to call me Anna. What about Irina? I really hate this name and I don't know why. Uh, and Anna it sounds pretty but Anastasia is cooler. Uh, disadvantages. I have only two disadvantages. The first that there are a lot of girls with the same name and it uh, annoy me and I feel embarrassed and uncomfortable because of it. And the second this name is not unusual. At least in our city there are a lot of girls named Anastasia and uh, it's annoyed me too. Um, my own opinion about my name. The first, I absolutely like my name. I like everything about it. Um, the second, if someone offers me $1,000 to change my name, I will never agree to do it because it's really silly to give someone the big sum of money because of it. And uh, the last, if I have an opportunity to immigrate somewhere and I have to change my name, I will miss my uh, native name very much. Because one of my dreams is to relocate to South Korea and there is a rule that you have to uh, have the second Korean name. So uh, for the beginning, uh, for the first time, I will uh, feel myself uncomfortable because of it. Uh, I read a lot of information about character of people because of her or his name. My name, uh, my characteristic coincides to me. People with name Anastasia have a deep inner desire for order and uh, physical creativity and would like to be involved in uh, conventional and safe activities. And the second, they uh, value truth, justice and discipline and may be quick tempered with those who do not. So my presentation uh, comes to end. If you have some questions for me, I will um, be happy to answer for them. Thank you for your attention. Hello everybody, my name is Askar and uh, I want to introduce you my presentation which calls uh, my beautiful name. And uh, I prepared some information about my name. Mm, I prepared information about my name. Firstly, I want uh, to talk about uh, meaning of my name. Mm, meaning uh, what Askar 
means in my native language means beautiful mountains or top of the mountains. And uh, in the Kazakh poetic speech, it's uh, used as comparison with mountains that is high majestic mountains. And uh, second meaning is uh, uh, in my language. It second meaning of my name. It's uh, support, uh, very high, unapproach unapproachable and inaccessible. Mm, and uh, I want to tell you how my name mm, occurred. Uh, word Askar uh, is translated from the Arabic language as army, soldier, defender, or guard. And uh, in the Arabic language, uh, it sounds so Askar. And uh, mm, when using information of compound, uh, diffi of difficult compound, name serves as synonym of the top of something, mm, of the top something, or. And uh, I think uh, I have a lot of meanings uh, in my name, and I think it's very cool uh, to have uh, such name. And uh, I found some famous people with my name. And uh, for example, it's uh, mayor of Southern Kazakhstan region. His name is Askar uh, Mirzakhmetov. Uh, he's uh, very he's he's enough famous person in our not only in our city but in the Kazakhstan. He he has very good authority. And he does very useful things for our population, and uh, people respect him and appreciate him. And the second person is Askar Akaev. He is the ex-president of uh, Republic of Kyrgyzstan. Uh, he, he is famous as scientist and uh, politician person. Um, and uh, when he was president of Kyrgyzstan, his uh, country was prospering very well. Um, but unfortunately, he was kicked from his place because of mess in his country. Second, uh, third person is Askar Jumagalif. He is a minister of transport of uh, our country. Uh, he is not so famous in our country, uh, uh, and uh, some people can't help knowing him because he got his job in this year. Mm. Yes, uh, fourth person is Askar Junspekov. It's a uh, singer of our city. He sings uh, Kazakh national music, and uh, but he is not so popular in our city. Uh, but he's, he has, he has uh, a very good voice, and uh, some people listen to him and appreciate to him. Uh, and uh, Askar Mamin, he is a uh, president of a company which calls Railroad of Kazakhstan, um, and uh, he has been working f uh, for this job for a long time, and uh, a lot of people know him. But before he worked as uh, mayor of our capital. Uh, and uh, he worked in very important places, mm, but and uh, he, I think, he has a very good popularity in Kazakhstan. And uh, my mean, uh, my opinion about my name, why I love my name, I love my name because I get used to be for it. Uh, I think there are no reasons to hate your uh, name, but some people hate their names because uh, they are very long and uh, it's too hard to remember. Mm, and uh, my. Uh, uh, I think my name is very unique and uh, easy to remember. Uh, my uh, my sister named called me Askar, and at the age of five, and uh, I appreciate her decision. And I think uh, she uh, she called me so because she wanted uh, that I uh, all uh, was at the top, and uh, I must wear this name, and I always want to be at victory top. And uh, that's all what I want to tell. Thank you for your attention. If you have questions, to me, you are welcome. And uh, today I want to celebrate uh, with uh, today's holiday. It is the day of uh, our first president of our country. And uh, I would like to tell you about my beautiful name. Big blood. Uh, the meaning of my of my name. Uh, big blood. Uh, big blood translate from Turkish uh, language. Um, uh, for words B means uh, ruler, uh, prince, uh, and gentleman, as a synonym of um, um, uh, Arab Emir. Um, translate from the Kazakh word. Uh, words uh, bolat literally means uh, a steel. Uh, the meaning a strong, uh, a strong, persistent man. Uh, 
uh, another value so be bold and courageous um, Turk word Boat uh, was born from Persian word uh, Folat. Um, it is a special uh, type of steel um, that <coughs> uh, which uh, thanks to special technology um, the different kinds of internal structure and appearance um, suffer uh, surface uh, high hardness and elasticity. <coughs> um, see that. Uh, element name water. Um, if the first letter in the world belongs to the element of water, it is the first necessary to solve the um, problems connected with the Mr. Home uh, family affection. Water. Water. Um, the letters of my name, uh, uh, letter B means soulful, romance, uh, stability, uh, punching power, they decide to provide for uh, his financial life. And letter E means uh, the need for uh, self-expression, the exchanges of ideas, uh, a tendency um, to act as a mediator inside um, to enter into the world of secret forces uh, can tell uh, and you can read read all this let's okay okay uh, let's say k introduce uh, origination from the power of the sprint the ability to keep secret the credo of all or nothing and double let's be uh, let us see let us see means deep Feelings, the ability to handle money, the <coughs> the presence of this letter in the name uh, inside is the um, purpose of man. Uh, you just intuitively select from the bustle of extensions. <coughs> uh, letter L, uh, uh, sub subtle perception of beauty, artistic talent, the desire to share the uh, knowledge and Mm, feelings. Uh, let's say A. <coughs> uh, symbol of the um, beginning, the search for uh, for spiritual and physical com comfort. <coughs> and letter T. Um, sensitive, creative person, a seeker of the truth, uh, is not always weighed uh, against the desire and opportunity. The symbol of the cross uh, reminded to the own that the life is not infinite uh, and should not be put off until tomorrow. What we can do to today? They act with every minute eff effective. Uh, thank you for your attention. If you have uh, any questions, uh, welcome. Hello everybody, my name is Camila, I'm one of the uppers. Uh, today I'm going to talk about the my, my name and uh, now I would like to talk about the meaning. At the end of my presentation I will ask you some questions. Uh, first, French meaning. The name Camille is a baby, f French baby name. In French, the meaning of the name means uh, a temple servant. But uh, it was it was used by many young attendants of priests and priests in uh, ancient Rome. Latin meaning. The name Camille is a baby is Latin baby name. Uh, it's it means from French form of Camilla or Camillus. Also, it was used as both girls and the boys' name. Uh, famous bar, the famous uh, Greta Garbo film Camille. Uh, people, uh, people with this name have a deep inner desire for a stable, and they love their family or community. Uh, they uh, they need to work with others and to be appreciated. They need to initiate events, and uh, uh, they have uh, powerful personalities. Uh, they uh, they. They tend to be focused on specific goals and experience of wealth, of creative new ideas, and uh, they 
and they have ability to implement these ideas uh, with efficiency and determination. Uh, they tend to be courageous and sometimes aggressive as unique uh, creative individuals. They tend to uh, they tend to resent authority and uh, they are sometimes stubborn, proud, and impatient. And our first famous people, her name is Camila Belarus. She was born in Los Angeles. Uh, she, mm, she her first major work as actress was in soap opera Walker. She also starred in such films like Invisible Circus and uh, A Little Princess. And our second uh, famous person, she, uh, her name is Camila Skogward. She's a designer of shoes. She's very talented. She won all honors in shoes industry. And uh, her motto is, my shoes must be laconic, fashionable, and uh, unusual. Uh, her name is Camila Guaita. She's an American singer and uh, actress. Uh, her, she, Camila Guaita uh, is known for her role in the Disney film Gotta Kick It Up and she also starred in such films like uh, 30 Days Until I'm Famous and uh, mm, in, uh, family, Jordan, family Affair and Crossing Jordan. And I would like to talk about why I love my name. I love my name because it's very beautiful. And uh, uh, when, uh, when my mother studied at university, uh, she had got a friend, Camila. Uh, she was very beautiful, well-educated from a noble family. And uh, my mother admired her and wanted her daughter to be similar to her. And uh, uh, she, because she had went well, uh, she was, uh, and uh, she married a handsome guy from her circle and she was very happy. Uh, even, if I of, even if I was offered one million, I would never change my name. Now, as I promised you, I'm going to ask you some questions. Our first question is where Camilla Bell was born. Yes, it's right. It's for you. Uh, our second question is what kind of motto Camilla Skogot has? Yes, you. Uh, my shoes should be fashionable, laconic, and... It's right. It's for you. And our s last question says three films in which Camila Guaita was starred. No. Okay, I will answer. Uh, 30 Days Until I Am Famous, uh, Blue Moon, and Crossing Jordan. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your... Uh, if you have some questions, you are welcome. No Thank you for your attention. Hi everybody, my name is Patay and uh, I would like to talk about my beautiful name. Well, uh, for us, for Kazakhs, have a tradition and for us, uh, have a tradition. The grandparents uh, give name for grandchildren and traditionally my grandfather named me Spatai. And uh, it, everyone asks the value of my name because it's not of Kazakh origin. Uh, it's an Arabic word. It sounds like al uh, It means it means uh, for ages. Uh, it means uh, forever. And uh, I would like to talk about uh, some uh, famous people. Uh, we see the man in the picture. It's uh, Spatai Kharsabai. Uh, he was born in 1981. Uh, 1918. Uh, and in the village Turtkul. Uh, in 1942, he was uh, go to uh, front. In 1943, uh, he was uh, posthumously appropriated the rank of Hero of S Soviet Union. Uh, moving on to next uh, slide, uh, we see another man. He's Patay Alibegola. He was born in 1781 and he was died in 1768 uh, uh, he was a uh, Kazakh uh, hero and uh, uh, he was very respectful <coughs> and in conclusion uh, in conclusion I would like to uh, say what uh, why I like my name I like my name because it's very uh, unusual, it's very rarely, and it sounds uh, with character. And 
if you have some questions, you're welcome. Thank you for your attention. Hello, my name is Timur. I would like to tell you a bit about my name and about famous people with this name. This name is of the Turkish origin, came to us from ancient times. This name means iron. Uh, people with name Timur are similar in appearance to the father, but they inherit mother's character. Uh, since childhood, Timur likes going in for sport, adventures, journeys and games. Uh, I know about many people with the same name as mine, but today I will, uh, would like to tell you a bit only about three people. One of them from the history and one our contemporary. Uh, it's all um, people with the same name as mine. Um, from history, we all uh, we all know name uh, the name Tamerlan or Emir Timur. He was a Central Asian leader. He founded the state with its capital in Samarkand and destroyed the White Horde in 13th century. Uh, Emir Timur was a great general of Turkish army and a brilliant politician. Uh, he set up his military campaign in uh, Africa, in Europe, and in India. Uh, the second person is Timur Rodriguez. He is Russian showman, singer, TV and radio host. Um, <coughs> in his school and university, he took part in all uh, theatrical productions, but most of all young talent gravitated to music. Um, after his arriving to the capital, he uh, started to um, work closely with uh, TV channels, and later he began to present his music to, to the public. Uh, his famous musics are Out in Space, Will Not Be Better, About You, a song, uh, this song is for Michael Jackson, and many others. Uh, the three, third people is uh, Timur Bekmambetov. He is uh, a Russian film director, um, screenwriter, producer, and music video director. Um, Timur Bekmambetov um, um, made uh, that films as uh, the, uh, the Day Watch, The Night Watch, Black Lighting, um, and many others famous films. Uh, he recently added to his um, uh, merits uh, another um, honorary title, uh, the National Association of uh, Films uh, of Theatre of uh, U.S. Uh, declared him uh, the best foreign film director uh, in the world. Um, he's a founder and uh, a director of an uh, international association um, film festival Astana. Um, uh, that's all. Um, I really like my name. Um, every, uh, everything that I read in description of my name is true. For me, it fits my character and behaviors. Um, that's all. If you have any questions, I'm ready to listen. Uh, why do you like your name? My name is Yulia, and today I want to tell you about my beautiful name. Uh, first of all, uh, my name has uh, three meanings. It's a Roman version, Slavic version, and Scandinavian version. Uh, in Roman version, my name comes from the uh, Roman uh, name Julius, in Latin it means curly and fluffy. In Slavic version my names mean my name means uh, forever young or given rise in July. And now in Scandinavian countries this name gives to girls who were born in December and part of my name means Christmas. You can see now I'm going to tell you about famous people and first is Julia Roberts. She's an American actress. She was born in USA Atlanta. Uh, she has she acted in 43 films. She best she's a best paid actress in the world and 
she has an Oscar for Best Actress Role. Then Julia Lennon, uh, the mother, oh, you can see on the picture, uh, the mother of the British and uh, British singer and musician John Lennon. Uh, she was very close to her son. And uh, famous biographer and critic MacDonald uh, said that she was a muse for her son. Then uh, Julia Lermontova, uh, she is the first Russian woman uh, who was chemist, engineer. And Julia Savicheva, she's a Russian singer and actress. She's only 25 years old, but she has uh, many achievements in her life. For example, in 2004, she participated in the project, project Eurovision, and she is a graduate of the project uh, Star Factory 2. So, in my opinion, I have a v really beautiful name. I like my name because I was named uh, in honor of my grandmother. And I can't find any minuses of my name because when I did this presentation, I, fa I found many interesting facts about my name. My name is used in 16 languages and my name has a, a very interesting how to say uh, forms for example I can be Julia Juliet Jule Leah and I want to say that many people many famous people uh, with this name very creative and I think if you want to know something interesting about your name you should uh, read your meaning of the name. So, um, I really, I really proud of my name. That's all. If you have any questions, you're welcome. <coughs> Thank you for your attention. Or they will cry listening to your English. So, or they will actually swear at you. <laughs> so, watching you actually uh, pervert <laughs> the native language and so on. Right? Good. So, anyways, thank you for coming. Thank you for not being um, yellow bellied. Right? So, thank you for, for taking um, this encouragement to come here and to actually to show what you have prepared. So. This, this will be evaluated and so you will know the, the mark, I don't know, maybe as soon as possible, but usually it takes about three, four days to evaluate your presentation, right? So I guess you will know your marks to, along with the final, final test scores, right, at the I same time. The According to the timetable, so the next lesson, you come, so as usual, here class and you have your final test mm -hmm. so it means that don't forget that this is your writing so it is the part of your final test but you have a chance to do it at home okay do you have any questions 